Alright, so for those of you just tuning in, we are about to do some 4v4 arena between me and my viewers. Throughout this match, I will be explaining the thought process behind my decisions as well as giving general advice on how to play Age of Empires 2. But of course, brief disclaimer as always is it's much easier for me to play when I'm not commentating, so might make a few mistakes here and there, but... Oh, I'm the Incas! That's just wonderful. Yeah, I'll do the best I can to explain what a player better than myself would be doing, I guess, in my shoes, but... Oh, God! I'm the Incas. Oh, no. Oh, my. I'm glad I got this little llama fellow over here. That's, uh... So this llama is just actually a sheep? Okay, so I guess the Incas do get a uh, kind of nice bonus in that regard because, you know, if I can't find my sheep for any reason, I guess I do start with one. <laughs> I'm gonna man mode this, guys. Incas versus uh, the Byzantines is probably like the worst thing in history, and by that I mean Incas versus everybody because the Incas are honestly not very good, but, but, you know what, I'm not, I'm not a wuss. I'm not a wuss. If, if there's one thing I've shown you guys is that uh, Resonance doesn't take crap from anybody, except for occasionally maybe to tradies. That does happen sometimes, but... Uh, in this particular case, to tradies not in this game, and uh, I'm all for the struggle. I have not really played much of the Incas for good reason. I've been warned to stay away from them. And if the struggle wasn't real enough when I play something else, it'll be nice to uh, play with a significant handicap this time. So, hopefully you guys find this one's particularly interesting. If I do win this, it'll be cause for celebration, I suppose. I'm right next to Anthrax, which is always good. Anthrax, what a friendly name. Like, that sounds like a great guy. Anthrax, that, that sounds like the kind of person that I'd want at my children's wedding someday. Now, uh, okay, those are my boars. I'm gonna say the two of these sheep are Jumad bros, and I think that this other one is mine? So that's what I'm gonna say. I'm gonna do a little bit of scouting. At least he doesn't have a llama. Oh no! There's no sheep under my TC. Is that one of my drinking game rules? I've been too distracted. I shouldn't. I should not be typing to people in this game, man. There's no. You can't have smack talk. I'm playing the Incas. It's a. It's time for serious tryhard mode, guys. There ain't no time for smack talk. This is war. Oh no! Don't worry, guys. Alarun will absolutely demolish me this game. I'm playing. I'm playing Incas versus Byzantines. So it's going to be a struggle this time. <laughs> Wait, do I still have the text on the screen? I, okay, I, I just misclicked it, guys. I, I thought I thought I uh, turned that off before I left, uh, briefly. My bad. The thing is, is, there's a huge delay, right? So even if I read what I see on your screen, it'll take you like nine years for you to actually see that I've read it. So, I did read that quickly, it's just it's hard for me to... Uh, I guess, be a time lord. I'm working on that, though. As soon as I can do that... <laughs> can I send it in? Far too lazy. Anytime, man. Oh god, I gotta be watching my boar meat. Rez, I don't know if you saw, but you're an inspiration to Zero Empires' channel. He's a link. He has a link from his interview on his YouTube channel. No, I know I didn't actually, uh, but I would love to see that. That sounds very, very cool. I know that he actually uh, has, has seen my stuff before, which is very, very flattering. I'm a huge fan of Zero Empires. If it weren't for uh, guys like him and BBQ Turk, man, I probably wouldn't have gone back to YouTube. But I saw how you know they're always raising the bar on how uh, quality they can make AOE2 content. That uh, you know, it's it's inspiring. It really is. So I'm very glad to hear that he. Both actually knows who I am, and two, he uh, enjoys my stuff. Alright, Mrs. Villager, time to do some teleporting action. I'm gonna go rift walk over there. 
Hello, Madeira. I'm glad you got to actually make it to this one. You've uh, come just in time to watch me meet my demise at the amazing Incas. <laughs> I gotta be the Incas this time, which is, uh, that's gonna be an experience. Yes. Incas are not the best Civ, unfortunately, but, but I think I can make them work. I think I can make them work. Maybe everybody else is just wrong, and the Incas are the greatest thing since sliced bread. You don't know. Nobody knows. Maybe I know something you guys don't know. Maybe I was born Incas. Wait, I need a... Wait, why is there a Jew Mad Bro Scout in my base? What are you doing? You don't need to be here. I need to scout my base. It's crazy talk. Now come on, get... Wait, the llama makes the elephant noise. Are you seeing this delay, by the way? You gotta, you gotta time when, uh... When I click, and then, uh, when it actually reacts. Like, that's what you gotta do. You gotta figure out how long the delay is for me. Alright, we'll get some of these, uh, these deer hunted. Sounds like a plan. Review for Fast Castle Age. Why? Because it's Arena, and on Arena, well, you're not going to get any actual attacks accomplished in the Feudal Age. Those are pretty hard uh, to actually do, because you start with stone walls. So, might as well get to the Castle Age, in which I can get some siege weapons out and actually do some damage. If you're wondering why the Incas are considered suboptimal, well, uh, they don't. Uh, they don't get a great selection of units. I mean, for one, their Eagle Warrior bonus of just extra movement speed. Uh, the term sucks balls is a little accurate. It's not... <laughs> I mean, you've never really looked at an Eagle Warrior and been like, yeah, yeah, I wish they were faster. Not that they... I don't want them to, you know, be tankier because 60 HP is oh so much. <laughs> or I don't want them to do more damage because 9 attack is too high. It's, uh... I just wish they were faster, said nobody really ever. They're plenty fast on their own, that's for certain. Really? I didn't kill that? Okay, there we go. They're pretty fast on their own. Obviously, Squires is nice, and you know, you do want them faster, but it's not the equivalent of the Aztec and the Mayan bonuses of extra 4 attack or 40 HP. Not even close. So that's a problem right off the bat, and you know, the Mesoamerican civs kind of rely on having strong eagle warriors and not really having e access to eagle warriors at all in the form of the Incas is interesting. But the Incas do have access to some things at their disposal, so we'll see if I can exercise my creativity and get this show on the road. They definitely, they're not like, it's not unwinnable, I can do this. Actually, I should just advance. Hello, Drew. They do have a llama, guys, and llamas are just so good. It's like a... They're like a sheep, but cuter. Oh, wait, no. Anthrax is... Oh, so I'm next to Alarun. I was just confused, because uh, teal and green look almost the same uh, when the fog of war. You. What the hell, deer gatherers? That's that's worse than a split. That's like that's like Satan, guys. All right, get back in the base. Go chop some wood. Sounds good. Sounds good. Everything is actually going not bad. Now the delay unfortunately fluctuates, Kieran. So. It might be that way now, and I hope it stays uh, around that that size. That's the hope. But I don't know. Notice how this entire time, I'm making sure my town center is always working. It should either be creating a villager or uh, researching something all the time. And the reason is, is you want to get, like, the golden rule number one of AoE2. 
is that you want to get your goal of 100 plus villagers ASAP. I think he's asking if he can like fling or something. That's fine, I guess. I mean, my house is giving me double pop. That's that's something. It's baby steps. All right, here's Breeze. Hmm. So you want to reach you reach your goal of 100 plus villagers ASAP. That's like rule number one. So your town center should not be idle. It should always be producing villagers or researching and technology at all times. And then, uh, Varrier Army Composition is rule number two, basically. And I guess if I had to add a rule number three, it's, uh, don't forget your upgrades, especially the blacksmith ones. I wish I could see what he means by that. I bet it is a pretty, pretty sad lumber camp. <laughs> Where's what country do I live in? I live in the United States, sir. California. A place of extremely nice weather. So I get like Kamayucks, right? And I get Slingers. Slingers do not seem too bad. Probably find a use for those. <laughs> oh, I feel like such a I feel like a terrible person, but I'm totally gonna do it. <laughs> People do this to me all the time, so why not? I think I'm attacking the same one, right? Okay, the shirtless male, yes. I'll get you first. He told me to. <laughs> Just following orders, ma'am. Oh my god. We're all terrible people. Coordinated attack. I'm going straight to hell, guys. Are you missing snow on Christmas? Of course. I love the snow, but uh... Nothing but a I'm nothing but a simple carpet merchant. Would you like to see my wares? Alright, give me this uh <laughs> I, I gotta delete these walls so that I can put my town center, my new town center, because the first thing you should do when you hit the castle age guys is more TCs. I need to put them in an area that they are ideally next to both minerals and trees and there's room for farms there should be space for like c1 farm between them yeah nailed it and then when my next tc comes up i can just build the uh get lump i can get a wheelbarrow next to alarun my arch nemesis my other other arch nemesis What's the plural of arch nemesis? Arch nemesi? Arch nemesises? <laughs> arch nemesises. Oh my goodness. Now that's a mouthful. <laughs> Trying to reach that goal of 100 plus bills ASAP right now. That's what I'm doing. So, I got all these extra TCs. I need to start focusing on getting my food income up. To be able to afford my new bills. Thankfully my ha- Okay, actually the income sound like the sieve for me. Because I tend to get screwed by having no room to build when I play arena. Uh, no room for my houses for the most part, like Black Forest map generation sometimes likes to 
ruined my day by not giving me any room to build, but that shouldn't be a problem anymore because the Incas get like 10 pop per house, which sounds pretty swell to me, if I do say so myself. So, perhaps Inca's actually OP and not UP. Maybe. <laughs> now you're the other other arch nemesis. I got like I got like eight of them, man. But uh, my true arch nemesis, guys, it's not actually Tetrades or Alarune. It's actually Forty Nine Food is my true arch nemesis. Him and me, we don't get along. You know, he's always he's always nipping me in the butt. Either that or lag. I think lag is actually my true arch nemesis, and I think that uh, lag is the arch nemesis of really all the players I just listed. <laughs> I'm gonna say lag. I'm gonna say lag. Uh, you know, and he's got his little minions called map generation. Uh, map generation always sucks, and 49 food too is also pretty bad. But uh, I think lag is the real super villain, guys. Every time your game is lagging, just picture a really evil-looking guy with a mustache laughing maniacally in his chair while he's massaging his cat. And by cat, I mean wads of thousands of thousands of dollars. Oh yeah, yeah. See, look, look, look. You know, Shalatopin, man. He, he's reminding me in a totally serious fashion that I've got the best, the best of bonuses, guys. I've got them where they count. I start with the free llama because fuck it. Uh, my villagers benefit from blacksmith upgrades because fuck it, and uh, my houses give me ten pop because fuck it. Oh, buildings cost minus fifteen percent stone. It's almost useful. Actually, it does kind of add up in the long run, but. Maybe use the Incas for tower rushing. I mean, that's what I should do. Huh. They got potential, though. Not all their bonuses suck. They're just weird. The Incas were designed with a sense of humor in mind, I guess. Do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do
Okay, I got a barracks out. I feel powerful. Not really. Uh, get an archery range too, because cool. <laughs> Why not? Okay, now I have way too much food and no wood. Okay. AoE two gods, what are you doing? <laughs> Llama trade carts. Hello, llamas. You guys are great. Okay, so I guess the Incas are the lazy man Civ in the sense that, uh, they don't really do anything, but you don't have to worry about building houses, so... I mean, they sound like my kind of Civ. <laughs> Except I actually like to do something, so I guess that's different. I miss Joey, Militia, Sander, and Julie. Those poor villagers, guys, they didn't... they didn't make it. They didn't last. I wonder if I can kill some gold miners over there. I wonder if that's a thing. They died so young. I guess this is the TC that's gonna do it. Oh, the Yavils are all so dead, sir! This is all part of the master plan. Haha! -ha! Triple kill! Oh, the jukes. I'm playing dirty. Oh, this castle's not up yet. I sold all those resources too. Now I just look silly. Build that castle, please. Llama carts would, would actually be pretty cool. I, I, I'd, maybe I'd play the Incas then. For novelty purposes. Alright, you guys look at the scores right. If your score is bad, man, that means you just your bills. Where are your bills, guys? It's uh what time is it right now? It's like four PM guys. Do you know where your villagers are? <laughs> I believe it was uh no varied military, no villagers, no service. That's the uh that's the restaurant motto, right? I need a, a university. Uh, what's my siege like? Please tell me my siege is good. It, it's fine. Gets the job done. It's like Subway. It's not good or bad. It just gets the job done. It's a meal. I mean, at least it's healthy. <laughs> Now people are gonna be, people are gonna rag on me for uh, hating on Subway, man. I'm not hating on Subway. I like Subway, guys. I eat there all the time. But I'm just saying it's not gourmet food, but it's uh, it's healthy, so I give it that. Wow, such Kamiok. <laughs> if only they were good. Alright, Slingers. So these are good against infantry. And he is the Byzantine. I'm already fucked. This Civ matchup is so not in my favor. <laughs> what do I have to deal with this junk? I'd I don't know. Well, if there's one thing I've uh, I've practiced that proficiently, it is somehow pulling games out of my butt through a struggle of very, very tangible variety. Well, I'm actually gonna need more houses. Like straight up, I'm gonna need more houses. Oh no, I'm in your house now! No, it's gonna happen! No, I must cease military production. Effective immediately. I might be able to get away with it. Fuck. 
<laughs> Alright, that's a drink. Oh, I've got a... <laughs> the world's most ghetto trade line, okay. And what about over here? Anthrax, actually, that's not, that's not bad. I'm gonna roll that one. And then uh, another gate over here, please. And uh, we're good. We'll get uh, uh, upgrades I can't afford, okay. I'm okay with that too. Are right, you want a bump? Let's bump. I'm a bump champ. <laughs> the bump master. Ooh, Onager City. Except for this guy. This guy's just sitting around not doing Onager things. What do I pay you for? Don't tell them I don't pay them at all. That makes them angry. Oh, God. He's got gunpowder. He's got gunpowder. Alright, I killed it. I did it. Yeah. I'm gonna need I'm gonna need more Onager support. <laughs> as well as backup from my immediate teammates. Please send me your things so that we can get with the uh, conquering thing. Yo, Jumadra, please. Okay, I've got nothing for those gunpowder units. That's what's so stupid about, uh, this, uh, the whole Incas thing is it's incredibly realistic in the, in the aspect that there's no real, uh, conceivable way I have to actually kill those stupid, stupid siege weapons of his, those long-ranged, uh, hand cannoneers. I, I don't really have anything for those. I'm not equipped in that regard. I need some serious, serious help, yo. Oh, this is... I need someone to kill those bombards. <laughs> Focus cannon, please. Well, I can stall the trash. That's one thing I can do. I think I need more farms. Gotta balance up my eco a bit. If I'm not watching the chat, I'm sorry. I have to kind of focus, because... I don't have much at my disposal in terms of units. <laughs> so I must use my brain power. Still do read the chat, but if I don't have time to respond, then you know why. It's the struggle right now, man. Alright, we back! <laughs> Ain't even concerned. Oh my god. So many dudes. <laughs> 